Hi, welcome to number four of my simple finger picking tune videos. Uh, this is this one is assuming that you've looked at the previous three, so these are definitely worth going through in order. So I would look at the first one, then a second one, and so on. So this is number four. Um, it's a bit of a, a change on this one. Um, it, the the pattern with the right hand is is varied a bit more than it was on the previous ones. And the whole idea of all of these tunes is that you you start off thinking about this hand and then your attention comes away from it and it can, it can kind of carry on on its own without you thinking too much. That's the, the idea with these. So this one, I'll just, just play through it so you can hear it. Okay, it's Okay, so the pattern to begin with, with this hand, starts off simple, we're not using the left hand. It's similar to, to the other ones we did before. So that's the first section, is, is just that without this hand. And I'm playing, in terms of strings, 4-3-2-1, 5-3-2-1. 6321 6321 so. and that then repeats but you start using this hand so what we have to do then is on this first string just using one finger play second fifth third open to tie in with with the pattern this hand's doing. So it's. And then. And then. And then back to open. Obviously without any pauses. So that section is. And when I played it just then, I stopped the notes from ringing, the, the high notes. Uh, what you can do is let these ring, and just using one finger, keep the pressure on the string so you actually get a sliding effect in between. It sounds like this. Which is quite nice. Okay, so the next part, this hand's still doing the same thing. Four, five, six, six. But we hold a shape here, which is that. Let's call an F major 7 sharp 11, which isn't that important at the moment. And you just hold those two fingers there. So this is third fret on the fourth string, second fret on the third string. So we hold that shape for the first three patterns. one on the sixth string, change to first finger, you have to be careful that that finger doesn't touch the other strings. So that section is okay moving on the next one this is where this hand now changes so we hold a similar shape to the last one, such as C major 7 that you may know, which is that. So it's like the last one, but we just move these fingers across. With this hand now, we keep, keep on that, that shape. We play fifth for the bass notes, fifth, fourth, sixth, fourth. So it's first change to what this hand has to do but we've compensated for that by making this hand very simple it just stays on that so 
So I'll just play through from the beginning. Okay, so the next part, we just have one finger there, second finger is probably best. So on the fifth string, second fret, which is a B. And with this hand, we do the fifth string bass note, then the fourth, and then something changes. So we go. And then this hand, we have to go to an A sus2 chord, which is this. So they're both second fret, this one's on the third string, that's on the fourth. So we've just come from here. Swap across to there. And now with this hand, we play the fourth string bass note, fifth string, fifth string again. So it's So that little section with those two parts is. And then on the end, this finger, this is weird, this part. I don't know why I added this part, but it sounds quite nice. So this finger slides up to the seventh fret. So you can stay on that same string and just play the fifth and the fourth together like this. That's and that's slightly tricky to try and get the timing on that part. Uh, there's another thing you can do there as well, which is slightly harder, but instead of going, you can make this note a harmonic. Uh, you may or may not know about harmonics. If you if you don't. It's probably best to look at those separately first, but um, but I can do a harmonic at the seventh fret instead of playing that note. Do a harmonic, which is the same sound but an octave higher. Harmonics aren't always an octave higher, but this one is. And I'll play that at the same time as this open A. So that last part now will be. quite nicely but that's quite a bit harder so initially just go for the and you might notice that note is still ringing when I play those it's quite nice so we're hearing that as well as those and that's the whole thing so as I mentioned earlier, it's, it's a bit more um, sort of mixed up for this hand than, than the previous three that we've done. But that's intentional. That we're, that's what we're trying to do is complicate what's happening here um, as you get, get used to doing this. So uh, I hope you get on okay with that. If you like the video, please subscribe and um, there'll be more of these finger picking tunes. Okay, thanks.